everybody, I'm Tom Vassell. Welcome oh. to the day. Oh, sorry. No. Let's start this again. Hi everyone, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Camilla. I'm Z. And welcome to the, the <laughs> welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the Dice Tower. I was Tower. ready for one. So Voting <laughs> Bracket Showdown. We haven't done one Voting. of these in a while. Because they are a decent amount of work off screen. We got Roy, who's going to be showing you all the brackets. There's some setup work that we have to put in. And Chris is then running the polls. So we're going to, today, today, before we start, we're going to say thank you to some of our Kickstarter backers. Hey, yo. Can we rank these people? Again? We can. Oh. All right. Let's so we uh -huh. have yep. um, Matthew Romanda. Number one. Gareth Smith. <laughs> Oh, number one. <laughs> Lars Hoffman. <laughs> Ooh, numero uno. Jason Trutman. However you say number one in German. David Phillips. <laughs> Sean Roberts. Number two. Brandon Collins. <laughs> and Free Hugs. Free oh. Hugs? That's the new Ooh, number one. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. thank you, everybody. Yep, You're the yep, best. Yep. Alrighty, so what, here's what we're doing. We've done best board game covers before. We've done worst board game covers. Mm -hmm. uh, today we're doing best board game covers of 2023. I see. I now, actually, pick. a few of these have shown up before when we did best board game covers because I already knew the covers of the games, oh. so I was able to stick them in. I don't remember which ones were. I remember maybe a couple. Did any of them make it past first round? I don't remember. They didn't win. I remember. With incomplete data. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's. Uh, That's, the the way it is, That's what they call me. He does not lie. So, I just picked 64 games I thought looked pretty good. If there's a game that you think should have made the list, uh, yeah, maybe. I don't know. You guys don't even know games are on the list. No, yeah. I, I don't, don't know. know. I know two of them. You do? What yeah, do you know? it's the ones we just saw. Where? In Bryce Test. <laughs> what? You want to know what they are? Uh, well, we're about to see no. them. No. So, we're going to no. do a matchup, single elimination. You get to vote. Chris is going to put a poll in the chat. So make sure you're watching the chat. If you're watching this not live, well, you're not going to get That's the fun. vote. You'll Stick just with watch. Us. Yeah. Um, Chris will put a poll in the chat, and you guys vote. We're just here to comment. And one game goes. And to try to sway the audience, right? 100%. Roman Coliseum style. The other, the other uh, game will uh, be eliminated uh, uh, uh. from Gamington. Wow. Like murdered. No, I'll just take it out of the library. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh. That would be horrible. Wait, yeah. that'll change my picks. Hold on. No, right, and that's actually a good point. Do not vote for the game based on if you like the game or not. Vote based on the cover. Some of these games aren't very good, in my opinion, but their covers are fantastic. So, so here we go. Fair. Is it the cover based on I like that piece of art, or is it the cover based on I like like the way it represents the game? No, you might not know every game. But if you do know the game, can that not not I like the game, therefore no, I like this no, cover. It's, it's based on the I piece of art. I think this art. cover represents the game and the, the the style. Like it's a very energetic one, and it's a very real time game. We had this discussion in the last one, and we and it completely. Did we blow you off then? No, no. Then this was like should've. a huge discussion all the way through. What are you? <laughs> no, I'm saying, okay. No, we had like, an issue with it. You guys need to go back and watch the don't video. Don't say we. I we? don't have an issue. Oh, I want to make the game that looks the best. Issue. I'm going to pick the prettiest box. All right, let's get started. We'll be here Glad all day this otherwise. subjective. First, we have Humans Are Destroyed, After Us, and the Apes Have Approached. Uh, Vincent Dutre. Actually, this is Vincent There's Dutre against Vincent Dutre. Versus Vincent Dutre. Oh. And I'm oh. Dutre. This is the brand new uh, 20th anniversary edition of Amon Ray. So, so interesting enough, After Us huh. is there's there's some wonkiness in this one because there's actually like I think six different covers of After Us. I've only heard of two. This is the original, and then they did a special edition one for UKGE that had Big Ben instead. Wait, what? Oh, no, is there's more the than iPhone. that. Actually. Really? For what else localized, is there? I don't remember. I just I, I think there's Tokyo Tower. For localized countries, they're really? going to have their own building in there, yeah. Okay. Oh. I think it's a better composition after us than Amon Ray. Amon Ray is yes. a lot of good pieces of picture of good pieces of artwork together. The other one is a great composition. Yeah, I think that's a good way to put it. I mean, not often is a you see something that has this much. I know when you want the point. I'm kind of a tie here. Oh, really? Because I don't. I think after us. I really like the bright colors of Amon Ray. No, a I lot. Feel, but I feel like again, or sorry, where I was going with that is like not often do I say like, oh, there's there's like blank spaces, you know, in here. I think it's really well balanced in After Us that with those, uh, the, like the the right side there that doesn't have anything going on, but it doesn't look unbalanced. It doesn't look empty. All right, let's look at the results. So, Almond Ray's a little too busy. Ooh, after Us. 
Got that there we one. Go. Sixty-six percent of the votes. Sixty-six percent. That's two thirds, if I know maths. That is two thirds. I wonder. Yeah, it has, job, a, has yeah. a grills. That's where, cool. Where That's cool. Going? All right, next. We're going to jump into two very different games again. Both, both by Vincent Dutre. Uh -huh. No, the uh -huh. world has been destroyed here. Yes. In Apiary, this is the B game against Darwin's Journey. So we have a very uh. colorful space-esque cover against a very stark cover of Darwin, who's obviously going to trip over something while he's walking. I don't love either one of these. But Roy, I think Roy thinks Apiary is one of the best characters of the really, season. Really, do you? Really? Oh, I feel very I strongly Darwin's journey here. Yeah, I, I do not care for Apiary. I was going to say, I don't like either one of these that much, but if I had to pick one, it's definitely Darwin's journey. Yeah. That other cover is so busy. That's it. It makes me feel it's very like, like bees like, everywhere, I like lights cover, everywhere. The, I feel. the cover is like yelling and screaming at me. and I, Yeah, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. <laughs> Vote for new panelists. <laughs> yeah, I'm no, I like I like AP. I like that colorful stuff to it. I still think now after having played the game that the space theme does seem very very tacked on, and we know that it was tacked on. But that that looks different than most space games. So it I think that it, it doesn't. It looks different. That doesn't mean it's like good. What was it originally? The theme just bees, like on Earth. How boring. Bees on Earth. Good Wilson. <laughs> The Darwin's Journey looks nice, Stark, but I would vote for Apiary. Let's see what everyone votes mm -hmm. it for. Oh, oh. Yeah. Ooh, Darwin's Journey does. I think, yeah, Darwin's Journey is just like classier look. I, I don't know. It just it's. Well, good thing we didn't. Uh, makes me more comfortable. Pick our winners <laughs> this time, Roy, because you would have picked that all the way to the top. Yeah. All right, now let's go to some zaniness here. Two zany s games. The first we have is Wild Tiled West. Um, Okay. And then against Waterfall Park. Waterfall Park is the uh, reprint of uh, Chinatown. And Wild Wait, is that what that is? is? Yeah, that is. Oh, I didn't know that. It's actually not just a. It's not not just a reprint. It's actually it's even more streamlined. It's like three pages of rules. There's I did not realize it was a streamlined. That was. Hmm? Anyway. Hmm. Um, I don't know. I like the cartoon nature of Wild Tile West a lot. Go back over to the other one, Roy. I want to. Oh, that is nice. That is real nice. Repos knows how to make their games look good. Oof. Yeah, that's that's my pick. Which one? Waterfall. Yeah, whatever. me too. Yeah. That's. I just like the Wild Tile West is a very action. It's very energetic. Yes. Oh, you're saying so the game matches the covers? So no. The covers no one cares about that. No, Wild that Tile, no, Wild Tile West doesn't match that cover at all. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're building a town. It has nothing to do with this crazy stagecoach yeah. ride. Have they made a good game about robbing a stagecoach? They made one about robbing a train. Oh. oh, that'd be fantastic. I don't know. Cold Express, but even that's not about robbing the train. It's more about shooting at other people on the train. You're kind of robbing the train. No, I don't think anybody's... I can't think of a game that has that as a as a central theme. I like that. All right, let's see what we get here. Who wins this one? Yeah, Waterfall, Waterfall Park. Park, baby. So far, I'm we right, haven't I'm seen right a close vote right yet. Here. Calling it yeah. every time. I'm calling it. And it's always been about two thirds. Yeah. You know. Oh, you're right. It's yeah. Mm -hmm. You're right. Maybe that's just built into the system. The polling mm -hmm. system is broken. Really? You think so? I don't know, idea. Chris is Chris is uh, manipulating the binding. numbers. I'm 40 of those votes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you got the macros. All right, let's go. Cats yeah. against Primals. Mm. We have Nikojima against Primal the Awakening. Oh, these nah, are I don't even so know what that different. Is. They really are different. Nikojima <laughs> is another amusement park for cats. That's the dexterity one with the strings hanging from poles, the game. <coughs> so, that looks pretty this cool. This to be... I thought it was like power lines that cats were hanging out on. That's not it? Yeah, they are. It I don't is, know yeah. what it is. They're, but they're part of an amusement park. Oh, okay. It's and cute. then the other one is just like one of those big... That's a pretty good picture of a dragon, although they managed to look at this dragon like straight center. Like he's not tilted one degree at either neat. angle. It's very unique. I like the, the focal point for me is more the guy with the giant sword. <laughs> it's really kind of what makes is the cover. Is that sword enough? There's no way it's enough. <laughs> that guy is dead. 
I like that. It's very cool. I like that one a lot. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I vote for the verses. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really I vote like for that. that. It's a good font. Yeah, <laughs> I vote for. That. No, I'm. I'm. It's a coin toss for me. Both of these are good. Yeah, I agree. I'll take either one of them. <coughs> Do you have water? I don't know. I turned my mic off, but hopefully it didn't blow out ears. You have something. I have something, okay. but I think that's. Sorry. All right, let's see who wins this one. Show results. Ooh, Primal. I actually expected the other one to win. Actually, but it is a lot closer, right? That's the it thing. Is, it's not two-thirds. That's just, just a little over half. They were just so different. That's what got me. It was like I could have focused on what they were very equal to me for very different reasons. You know what I mean? Like yeah. I don't know that I, how I would have voted on that. Well, the <laughs> next two are also going to be very different. We have a newspaper game against a armed gangs in the in um, in Brazil. So fit to print against Cangancelos. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that. I it's don't in know. it's in Portuguese, so I can't even ask Z. Nope. I refuse to help you. My mic's still off. I thought I turned it back on. It's muted. Oh. Oh, I have a mute button. Who knew? So anyway, I I like Thanks. I like both of these a lot. The one evokes kind of an old movie theme, in a sense. Yeah. And the other one is... I like... One of them feels like a board game, a modern board game, but, you know, this one feels like a storybook or a board game. The other one gives me, like, movie poster vibes. You can almost hear the soundtrack. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I I'm like, voting for that one. I like that one a little bit better than the, Kanga, Kanga Seido. See, I think I don't care for that one, but I think it's just, it's not... My style. I don't really care for I'm that Western that theme and stuff like that. It's very like you say. It looks like a movie poster. It's not a movie I'd see. So I'm kind of like, oh yeah. That's, Would you that's watch fine. the other movie? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. No oh, retort. Yep. Okay. It's like a sequel <laughs> yeah, to Zootopia, but it's just about a newspaper. Yeah. It's much more boring. It looks like a really serious Zootopia. Yeah. Yeah, but somebody says it's too chaotic. I think that's what I like. It looks like. You know, you're you're running the newspaper and trying to put it together. To me, it's a, it fits kind of with the newspaper vibe. I the like old, it. The old timey style of woodblock almost mm -hmm. art is really cool. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah. let's see who won. Oh, fit to print one now. Gosh, man, I'm like, you're really bad at calling these. Me? No, you're fine. I'm doing I'm doing great. Right? Yes. Yes. Uh huh. Look me in the eyes. No. <laughs> Don't do it. It's a trap. <laughs> All right. Next, we have some very different games. We go back to space with Last Light okay. against okay. Jerusalem. So two very different covers. We the Last Light, that very stark black versus white. That the split cover, which yeah. is one of my. But I really, really like that. Like that cover. The arc of like the that. ship is really cool. But really, Jerusalem is Devere. But I really like the shadow play in Jerusalem, like where you don't see their faces. It's you just see that old-timey light kind of shining down on it you know usually the faces and stuff are the the focal points i think that just that really sells me is the use of shadows in that um i gotta say if this game was not called jerusalem i wouldn't think that was the theme i would think that this was like um about a secret society <laughs> so yeah yeah, yeah, there, right? is something yeah. there is something assassin's creed about it right yeah oh that's a good way to put it yeah assassin's creed yeah i like it a lot I like jerusalem i think that's where i would go yeah, that's cool. Yeah, they're both good, but I like, good. I like that yeah. last light. Cause I feel like last light's a cover, kind of cover I don't see very often. Yeah. You know what it kind of reminds me of um, is that one where it looked like the part of the box cover was missing, uh, Ether Fields. Kind of reminds me of that. Yeah. Same effect. Right, yeah. right, right. With the very stark two things yes. happening. Yeah. All right, what do we yeah. got? Ooh, last light. There we go. All right, we still haven't had a blowout yet. Maybe and we haven't one. had a close one yet either, like really, really close. Oh, right. Yeah. That's exciting. Then we get to break the tie. All right. Next one, go back to early times of Age of Comics. They're early, but not early times, but early. Like prehistory? Yeah. Time of <laughs> comics is what I would meant to say. Yes. It's like prehistory, basically. <laughs> Against philosophy. Also prehistory. Oh, what is that? Never oh, even seen that. Cover. I don't think I've seen either of these. Age of Comics, I've seen. Out there, it's out there. Gosh, I love philosophy. Ooh, what is this game? What uh, have we had it? We, hold on, I can't even is... talk. Is it, where is it? It's Red Panda, right? That's the name of that company. 
Yeah, I don't think we got five. It might be a real small card game, and Mike Delisio stole it. <gasps> what a jerk. Well, actually, disappointing. <laughs> <You don't even laughs> I said Mike. Mike, yeah, I know. Mike, yeah, <laughs> the guy who used to be here. I love that. It kind of looks like a tree with all those symbols. There's a lot going on in that that I like. Oof, that's, Is that I, a that's donkey? an easy one for me. No, it's a fox. That sure looks like a, a Pinocchio thing where he's about to tell him to go to that island where he's going to get turned into a donkey. Um, it does have that thing where I it looks like it. a human with a fox head. Yeah, I love I that. I don't love that. Anthropomorphic. But other than that, like, again, the balance of it, everything, I, I really like the other one. This one, eh, whatever. You know what I don't like about this one? I love the style, everything. I think the people... I don't, I don't like what they picked for them to be doing, I think. Mm. Like that one guy turning around being like, we got a letter in the mail. See, I'm like, okay. Mm. I don't know. I just wish. I love the look. I love seeing I the Empire State I think through the his, window. That's his script for that's the, the comic. That's the script for the comic. Yeah, no, I get what's happening. Mm. I just, the people could be a little more interesting or dynamic or I don't know. Right. I think comic book art is not really my thing either. You know, just not having an affinity for comic books. So, yeah, I'm, I'm all philosophy. These both look really good. I'm on I'm a toss up. I here. like them both, but uh, let's, I'm going to let the people choose, hopefully. I'll let them oh, choose going to as allow well. Them? Well, no, That's I mean, very big of you. That's what this whole video is. <laughs> All right, what do we got? I love how everybody's like, "No, he types that Z. That's a script Z." I'm like, "I know, guys. I'm." No, uh, yeah, yeah. I get it. Philosophy. <laughs> hey, it's the first one. I, we almost broke a hundred votes. <sighs> okay, we have like less than half the people that are watching. Less. Yeah, I don't know if you could hear that. Less than half the people watching are voting. The polls are dropped in the chat. Boo, 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 boo. Oh, God, well, some people can't also, vote because they're working. pick based on the cover, not based on the game. All right, let's do our last two. Well, I, obviously they did here. Yeah, yeah, no, no. I, I'm not saying they're not. I'm just reiterating for people jumping in now. All yes. right, our, our next one here. And if we say you should vote for this one, do that. We have another reprint, Quo Vadis against Ooh. Voidfall. Zufatis. Zufatis. Did I write Quo Vadis on here? I did. One hundred percent, because you're old school like that. Okay, you knew Knizia back when he didn't have bow ties yet. They hadn't been invented. This one's super easy for me. This one for me is hands Zubatis? down Voidfall. No, I know. I'm kidding. Calm down. <laughs> and I like Zubatis. I like the artwork, but I don't know why. It it's a little busy. I think for me that that a one. A little is. busy. Oof. It's too human adjacent. But that Voidfall artwork looks exactly like that piece of artwork I bought from Gen Con. I wonder if it's the same artist, actually. Which one? Oh, that space. It's Ian O'Toole, oh, it says. So. Oh, I don't think I... Did I show you guys that? But it has that, it has this very look to it. It's a space with red. It's so cool. I got it done on one of those foil metal things oh, that we I have here. Oh, I think I did see it. You had it shipped here, right? Yeah. yeah. I really like that. Yeah, that Voidfall cover is fire. That's so good. I, I love if that Voidfall cover. wins Z, in honor of that, we will allow you to... Sort out and unpack Voidfall. For you the are a, you are a giving man. I told you I would do it for you if you'll teach me the game. But that was a trap. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't a trap. I gave full disclosure. Uh, <laughs> I will teach the game. We have to play it at some point. All um, right. I think Voidfall won this, but who knows? Let's see. Yeah, that's there the closest to the yeah. first blowout. That is. Voidfall could go the distance here. That is a stunning cover. It is. Again, with that minimal, like minimal kind of look to it, you know, you like think there's it's a minimal look. I mean, there's a lot of black, just plain black on there, even in the middle pen of it. The computer, oh, I like Chris. that. This pen oh, is. Oh no, the blue one is gone. It's I dead. love that pen. It's one of the best pens ever made. I huh? love it so much. All right. Mm, All right. That's, what is that? That's our first, fourth of them voting. Paper Let's paper. jump to the next one. We have a game that we just got recently, mm. Nova Roma, which that's definitely. Um, no, it's not the Miko's artwork, I think. It's not the Micho? Is it? I always it forget like if it's it. him or if I'm... it's someone who's like him. Against Arborea. I'm really Ooh, stuck on this one because I like, uh, again, I like both of these a lot. Do you? I don't like either one of these. Really? Yeah. That Roma cover is not good. What? Really? Why? I just don't like it. That's. Huh. A good argument. Okay. <laughs> no, I mean, it's all I got. Why do you, I not like it? I don't like it. me. Well, you usually give reasons. I, I I, just think it's, it's. I like that composition of the, the drawing and only he's colored in. I like that a lot. That's it's one a of cool my favorite idea, art sure. Styles. I don't like the fact that they put the staff and then the letters over it. They should have deleted that staff or moved the letters. I think it's a bad look. I hate the wreath. 
being both the O and the R. They're not lined up right. Ugh. The two letters don't, the two lines of text don't have enough space between them. Hmm. I just don't like it. And the uh, artwork well. itself is very like, yeah, it's me, the Micho adjacent is kind of what that feels like. This one I like a lot. This is what I was attracted to the game because of the cover. I just like it. It has kind of a, a funky, you know, Studio Ghibli vibe to it. It's interesting. The cover yeah. of this game is different than the art in the game. Is it really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. This is this is the art that I wish they had gone for in the game because it's a lot brighter, brighter and punchier. I think and they just couldn't. It. I think they got him to do the box and then couldn't get him to do couldn't, the rest of the game maybe. or something to that effect. Got it. Okay. Yeah, this is funky. I like this one much better. I, I, I still don't love it, but I like it much better. I don't know. I think I lean the other way towards Nova Roma, but I'm a real sucker for that, like, sketched into full completed picture type style of artwork. I think you're right, though. It's the composition of the Nova, Nova Roma one that I'm not loving. Um, Arborea, it's one of those that you can look at for a long time and still not feel like you saw everything without being overly busy, but it also, I don't want to keep looking at it because it just makes me tired. All right, let's see who won. Well, that is a, a two-thirds there. All right. Easy enough. Next, we go to horror movies Ooh. against, well, Frozen Water. We have Halloween against Ice. <sighs> the best you could come up with. Horror movies versus Frozen Water. You know what? I couldn't come up with something else, Chris. I don't know what to say. <gasps> so you, hmm. Hmm. Oh, what's that? You don't like either of these covers either? No, Ice is very, very nice cover. You that don't like Halloween? Cover. This is one of the best covers of the year. I don't know if it's best of the year. I do like it, and I think I, I lean Oof. strongly towards Ice. I think Ice, it's a really good cover. Okay. I, I mean, I like that it, it has more of a pencil Ice drawn. I think it away. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, no, I think it's more of like a pencil drawn look, and I like that with that Halloween theme as opposed to going something very B-horror movie kind of. Um, I think they easily could have gone with that type of art, and they didn't, and so I like the choice of how they represented it, but I think Ice is a much better cover. I mean, heck, I like that Nova Roma thing more than I like the Halloween one. Really? What? <sighs> wow. Here, pull them out. Let's look at them side by side there. Yeah. I don't know. I think, that, I mean, there's a lot of horror games I think that have pretty bad covers. I think that one looks good. It yeah. evokes the movie. Yeah. It's spooky, and I'm, I'm getting a little creeped out just looking at it right now. Yeah, no, I, I, <laughs> I think that is one of my favorite horror game covers. Okay. I don't All know right. if it's comparable on everything to Ice, but yeah, I like that cover. I think Ice is going to win. Let's see. Oh, what yeah. Happens. I think those bear first blow out. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, we're going to Nobody need to, beats frozen water. <laughs> we're going to we're gonna need to break the tie. <laughs> yeah, right? All right. Next, we have a Euro game from uh, Uwe Rosenberg, Planta Nuba, against the game Z likes a lot, Ancient Knowledge. Mm -hmm. This is an easy one for me. Really? Yep. I struggle with this because Ancient Knowledge is neat that it has that kind of fade into white. I'm just getting a little tired of that fade into white. There's so many games that do it. And Planta Nuba just looks fresh and interesting. It does. I, yeah. I have not played the Plant Anubo game, but I agree this feels like a landslide to me. And you never shall. It's a landslide which way? Plant Anubo. Really? Works. I'm a landslide. Oh, you are? Knowledge. I am. Oh, so seeing you're on the, on the wrong shelf, side of the slide. Seeing on the shelf, that's the one that my eyes would draw and go towards. I really like that. I like the, the how it's blocked out in the different colors. And again, that fade kind of almost has a watercolor feel to it. Yeah. I think Plant Anuva is a very good cover, to be to be fair. I think it is very, very nice, very pleasing. But my eyes just kind of go over and go to the, and sitting next to each other. My eyes would go to Ancient Knowledge 100% of the time. I do agree. Someone just said that the yellow logo's ruining that one a bit, unfortunately. That takes up a good chunk of that box corner. Yeah, but I like that at least it's framed with the black as well, so at least it goes into that ribbon, you know, and then you have the ribbon on the other side, so that balances it a little bit, but I do agree. It, I wish it was a little smaller. Huh. I have no idea what's going to win this one. Let's see. Planta Nubo. Oh. Yeah. There you go. Wow. Well, I'm being surprised a lot today. All right, you said I would never play Planta Nubo there. Is it really heavy? Chris thought it was dense and hard. I didn't say he thought it was bad. He just thought it was dense and hard. 
So I can I can't possibly comprehend it. Is what you're saying? I'm a big old dummy. Is what it's you're suggesting? <laughs> it's for smart people. Oh, I apologize. I I, <laughs> I pass. All right. Now we have Beauty Against the Beast. That's or, a good one. Okay. Barcelona see? Against That's the nice. Beast. All right. That's nice. I like that one. Barcelona. No, oh, you, oh, you his, like his, his thing. Comment. Oh, sorry, his comment. Uh, a oh. moment ago, he said frozen water. Remember oh, I that? know. Yeah, yeah. No, I did. Yeah. Trash. <laughs> this is Beauty versus the Beast. That's this one's it. I really like Barcelona. I think it's beautiful, gorgeous cover, especially for how boring a lot of board and dice games tend to look. Um, but the Beast one just looks so neat. Yeah. I'm pretty indifferent on Barcelona. Um, it's it's not one. Like, I think it's a pretty piece of art, but it doesn't draw me in. Um, I really like Beast a lot. I like that mm. central focal point with like the monster again, kind of that sketchy in the monster, and then it gets just more lush as it goes to the outside. I just I love the framing of that cover, um, and it without being scary, it's just creepy, you know. And I, I really like the composition of it a lot. So whereas Barcelona is like, oh, that's a nice cover, again, and then I move on. I want to go to. I want to go to Barcelona oh. at some point. <laughs> go to Beast. Oh, well. What does that even mean? Uh, don't don't tell me. I, I won. Both, both, of these, both of these are okay one. for me. Mm. All right. Woo! So the beast Beasty. has struck again. Okay, let's now. We got art versus science here. This is the art society against nucleum. So art society has a bunch of little pieces of art there with that crowded wall, and then nucleum is about, well, what is nuclear about? Is it about nuclear power plants? Yeah. Okay. It's converting from coal to nuclear. Converting from coal to nuclear. Fantastically, though, like with green science magic. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. This is the fur, I mean, I really, really don't like that cover. Nucleum? Really? Yeah. That might be the first one. Well, I said that a little while ago that I was like, how did the, <laughs> the Halloween, I guess, I really didn't understand being on this list. This would be the other one that I'm like, what? I really don't like Art Society. I do like Nucleum. I like the bright contrast with the dark really? colors as well. It kind of has that chaotic party celebration, but also a little bit of mad scientist um, feel. I, I like the vibe of it a lot. Art Society bores me to tears. I like Art Society. I don't know why. I like the little pieces. I like how they have some that are based on famous paintings and some yeah. that are just made up. Oh, that's yeah. interesting. Michelle says, uh, I like Nucleum, but every time it reminds her of Arkham Horror. That's true. I was like, that's true. It really and does that's look probably like why Arkham I like it. I'm like, yes, that's right. That's why I'm there. Like, yep. All right, let's yeah. see who who will lose in the next round. All right, Nucleum. Interesting. Yeah, I guess the Art Society sort of flat images thing just didn't work. Didn't work for people. The next two have mm. very different art styles. Okay, let's see. I'm, I'm ready Peak to judge them. Against La Grana. This is the reprint of La Grana. La Granja. La Granja. Sorry. That Mall Peak, I like them both. Mall Peak has that cartoony, really cool silhouette. Yeah. And yeah, La Granja yeah, yeah. is just beautiful. That's a really pretty cover. That's cool. Uh, the, the thick outlines on the letters, everything, everything's very bold. Mm. There's only like six shades of blue in there. That's really a cool cover. This one is just sort of technically beautiful, you know? That's a good one. Technically beautiful. That's a good way to put it. Thank yeah. you. It's like, That's oh. a compliment you should give people. Be like, you are, you are technically, technically beautiful. Technically a nice like person. Like if you asked the, the old masters, they would say, hmm. Donkey. I know. Oh, I have to. You I know, have to. Those no, you got to go that way. More yeah. donkeys. Donkey juice. Yeah. Donkey but I don't juice? Think, I don't think either Going of these. all the way with La Granja. Wait, what? I, I think either of these would, would lose next round for me. This is my vote for to take it all. There's a donkey on it carrying various I like them both, but I think juice. it's small peak. Let's see. Is there any donkey juice on that cover? I don't think so. Whoa. Wow. Whoa. That's the first one that I probably disagree with. Wow. Like, I, strong, like strongly disagree wow. with. Wow. I don't disagree with that. I, I'm okay. La, La, Mall Peak is a cool cover. I don't know if it's, it doesn't seem like it's enough for the cover. It seems like mm. it's a great cover of the rule book. Oh, I didn't know. You know I what think, I mean? Like, I it think, didn't quite, it, like. I would take it off the shelf and play it because of that. And it's like, oh, that's interesting. Tell me more about that game. And the other one, I'm like, granja. oh, that's a neat cover. And then I'd move on. 
Again, it, it doesn't like draw me and it's not something I want to know more about. It's not, as a board game cover, it's a b beautiful piece of art, but as a board game cover, it's not drawing me into the game. There's a donkey on it. Exactly. No. All right. No. no. Now it's Jepanu. Uh, the next one has one of my favorite covers ever in it. Okay. So we have the Glade against La Fam Famiglia. I think you just don't say the G, La Familia. La Familia? Okay. I think the Glade is a ni nice understated piece of art, kind of focusing there with the light. I like that. But I love, I don't know what it is. That, that cover is that so That cover makes me smile every time great. I see it. It's a wonderful piece. Like that, I could, I could seriously see that as a piece of artwork up on my wall. Oof. I really, really like I, that piece. I and agree. It's, there's something about it. It's very bold. It has that Weberson Santiago, like, punch you in the mouth look. It's only, again, it's like green and yellow, but then it's like, bam, house on fire. Boom. It's like red over there with that house on fire. Red scooter with two dudes. And one of them's carrying a bat. A bat. And it like tells the like, whole story. Did they beat the mansion to fire? I mean, like, <laughs> how? I love it. I, I love that cover. This one's like, oh, another nature cover. That's I just as like far the as light I in again, this one. I like the lighting. No, you have the Jacob's ladder coming down. I think. I think. It, and again, it has that you know dark on the outside coming to a focal point in the middle that I mm. really like. But. Um, I'm, I'm super indifferent on both of these. I do agree. Someone in the comments that the title gets lost. That's true. La Familia, yeah. That's why I think you should get it out of there and just not even get rid of all the writing. Just have well, the cover who speak won for this itself. One. I, love, I would like a third option. That's pretty much how I feel on these. <laughs> I love that comment. All right. And the last from our first half today, we have a game about saving the world and a game about cats. House of Cats and Daybreak. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. Daybreak's such a unique cover. I don't, I don't yes. love that art style, but I know some people do. House of Cat. I don't actually love either one of these. I do. I think both of these are are more my art style. I like. Oh, I have, I have a hard one, a hard time with this one because I like them both so well, then separately. You pick the one that does not showing cats. Seems obvious. I, I'm, I don't hate cats. Do you hate cats, Tom? Cats hate me. They you, started it. They started how do you feel it. about donkeys? No, I, I don't care one way about them. They care about you. <laughs> I don't like either one of these. I will really? pick Daybreak. It's slightly I, better. I like both of these quite a bit. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. All right, let's see who won this one. Oh, Daybreak. Daybreak yeah. But it's not, that's one of the closer ones, I suppose. All right, halfway. Next, we have dogs versus demons. This oh, is a fight on. I'm here How are you for. Do that? Park Avenue against Deliverance. Okay. Park Avenue. I just I, I don't Which know was why. With the dogs. <laughs> Park Avenue. I Oof. I really like that dog just being in the air completely. Well, the camera or the point of view or whatever is so low to the ground. You are it's a like fire a hydrant. You are yeah, you're dog about to be peed like on. A, yeah. You're also in the middle of the road somehow, Tom. How's the fire hydrant in the middle of the road? It's a uh, cross street. Let's go with that. Shut up! Don't ruin my. I like the point of view for sure. It's really cool. I I don't like Deliverance. So really? I think I'm going. Yeah, I, I don't care for that. I can't figure out what's going on. Maybe it's just it's too small. But yeah, it's just it's it's very. There's an angel. There's like nothing going on, but so much going on at the same time. Like. Okay, let me see. Fire, sword, wings. Oh, I do not like his head. And tattoos. <laughs> is he tatted up where? Oh, yeah, he is. Look at his arm. Oh, that's another person behind him. Oh, he's got a whole sleeve. He's a gangster. And now those tattoos look like similar to the Moana tattoos, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I don't love the dogs in Bark Avenue. I love the perspective. I think you're right, but I don't. Camilla well, doesn't love dogs. Happy. No. Heard this. Watch your mouth. No, um. Oh, so a they're a little, the faces are a little too real for everything else going on, so it's a little... I, I don't know. Wait, wait, wait. I don't love it. You think the face on that pug or whatever that is is too real? Oh, look no, at that look thing. Look at him. Look at the lab. The lab That's looks... That's the yellow one. Good. 
<laughs> what about fuzzy McNuggets over yeah, here? Yeah, no, it's a, it's a little too. I, I don't know. There's something about it. That's a little well, too real. Like, like <laughs> fuzzy McNuggets. But the deliverance, <laughs> I I don't like. So I'm I'm Bark Avenue. All right. Let's see who wins as what. It's probably the dogs, I guess. Yes. Yeah. Doggies. All right. Now we're more dogs in the next one. Oh, I guess what no, I am dragons. here for this. Perspectives. So we have Forever Home against Perspectives. What am I looking at? Well, Forever Home is, is that a, a grenade? I think yeah. it's a, is it an egg? Is it an egg? Yeah. I just think it's cool. I like that style. That's like a that's that's like a book cover, like a 1960s Cold War yeah. book. I love the style, but I feel like loving the style should draw you in and you start to understand what you're seeing. And the more I look, the less I'm understanding about the cover. Like, it's not... Oh, uh, it's showing you different things. I think you're... I see, like, there's a, uh, a there's statue. There's a cassette tape, a man with glasses, yeah. a revolver, a statue, right? Like a Buddha statue. Um, person with a looking... I, I love that cover. Oh, yeah. Someone says it looks like Saul Bass art. I love like Matthew's, who? like, an avocado. Sure, it's an avocado. <laughs> I like that. I really like that one. I... I like the use of the negative space, the suggested line around the hand. You know what it is? This is yeah, one that if great. I walk into, like, a vinyl store or a comic book store, I'm like, oh, cool, I like that for your wall. I don't personally, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like it has a place that's I like Forever Home. for me. I like the dog. I like the, that, that, comfort, that cover looks comforting. But I like Perspectives better. Yeah, perspective is a much more interesting cover, I think. Yeah, I, I don't really care for either of these. What about the dogs? Are they too realistic for you? No, this one's a little just too busy. It's a little too, like, I don't know, the nature's, like, encroached. There's so much going on. There's so many dogs. That lady and, should clean and, her yeah, front door. Forever home next week? I mean, no, it has, again, nothing to do with the gameplay. Like, I'm very excited about the game. But, no, the cover is not my favorite. I think up from that company, I still prefer Dog Park the best, like, by a landslide. All right, what do we got? Perspectives, there but it was go. not. It was not a. That means we will not have a dog versus dog round next turn. Mm. All right, next we have two games. Uh, Good. No kidding. I knew you were gonna say that. Rauha or Rauha? I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Against Sale. Well, this that, one's hard. The bottom of Sale really blends oh, into that, that background. Is, yeah. That's a rough background for it, didn't it? Oh, oh. I mean, I dropped it. Yeah, you got to you got to do give it a little stroke. Give it a little uh maybe an outline. There it there is. There we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. it's a square box. <laughs> it was hard to tell. It was hard it was to really see. Hard to tell. I like the first cover, but Sale is possibly, I'm not sure yet, my favorite cover of the year. So I, I think I'm there with you. I um, Sale is just a great cover. I love both of these, but Sale would probably be one of the top of the year for me. I would have like Sale I, framed and right next to it La Familia. I'm there. Those are my two you favorites. You know what I mean? I don't know why. Because it's like they came over on ships, it. then they burnt your house was down with bats. A <laughs> hundred years later, I think there's some that's time okay, difference. okay. Put a picture in the middle. It says a hundred years later, then. Yeah, that's a. That's a I like this. I do, I do no, like this cover. I love no, that cover. No, no. That sale is You a don't beast. like that cover? That's fine. I like it. Oh. But that sale cover. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, compared to fire, sale. Yeah. yeah. I think this one, I think Rauha would go a lot further if it wasn't against sale in this first round. Mm, I, maybe. I think that's, this would have beaten out a whole lot of other choices we already made for me. I am, one thing I am noticing is people are calling, like, some, one person said that the sale cover is ugly and everything. And that's the thing about the art. It's just, you're going to come in this and think every choice is wrong or mm -hmm. right, you know, right. whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but you're still wrong. I mean, there's no, like, subjective about this. <laughs> you're uh, right or you're wrong. <laughs> Let's see which one wins. Sale! Yeah. yeah. But it wasn't as big of a blowout as the Halloween one. All it right. is interesting. You're right. Hmm. Now we have two games I don't think either of you have played. I've, I've played. played the first one. Biotopes? Yeah. Mm. You have played that. Okay. Against mm -hmm. Maps of Mysteria. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Played that. Biotopes is yet another nature cover, and Maps of Mys I really like the cover of Maps of Mysteria. It looks so exotic, and oh, we're flying airships over this land. The game is soft focus on that is really neat. The Maps Gosh. of Mysteria there. The game that you played it, you liked it, didn't like it? I like it fine. It has nothing really to do with that. You're mapping out an area, but you're mapping it out according to the way it actually is, but also you might change some things to make your employer happy. They might want a lot of mountains. So, so you're, you're like, yeah, I saw mountains. mountains. This is interesting. I think 
I really, really like both of these, but I think I give the nod to Maps and Mysteria just because I think it is more unique. I mean, the Biotopes looks like it could be an expansion to Cascadia or something like that. You know, it, it kind of gets lost in, in a lot of the nature games where I think Maps and Mysteria stands out. Being said, I adore both of these. This is a really nice cover. I will say, of all the nature-y covers that have come out lately, I think this might be one of the very best ones. Oh, my gosh, right there with, like, the... Oh, just They're using point light one. through, like... Yeah. There's not just depth of focus there, but usage of light. I like this cover better than I like Cascadia. Yes, oh, I, yeah. There's I like so. shady parts. You go to the mountain for that soft focus. I mean, there's a lot happening there. Yeah. I like that, I think, better than... I don't love the title at the top. Uh, that's okay, but... Yeah, I agree. That's the weakest part of that cover. Mm -hmm. It doesn't really that fit the in next with it, right? Cover. But yeah, no, I, I agree. Well, let's see who won. They're both really good. Ooh, Maps of Mystera. Yeah. Wow. Okay. That's a gorgeous cover. All right, next we have Portals against a game Camilla likes a lot. Trailblazer, and I don't have the whole thing here because I couldn't write it out. The so John, John, John Moore John trail. trail. Yeah. I think these are both really cool covers. That Portals cover, that just looks awesome. Walking through a portal into another one. I like that mm, look. Yeah. That I want to. So I haven't good. played this game. I want to play it based on this right. cover. That is so. Their good. usage of color here, especially on the, again the font, taking a little bit of that green in the far distance, using it on the lettering, the viney thing happening yeah. on the circle. Oof. Yeah, like the background has that kind of Weberson Santiago kind of look to it, but then the front doesn't. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I like that one a lot. Again, these are probably two of my favorite covers of the year, but then, man, do I love that trailblazer. Like, it just feels inviting and nostalgic at the same time of hiking and a little bit playful with the Andrew Bosley artwork, you know, a little cartoony, but still real enough to be a memory, you know? Like, I just, oh, I absolutely love it. It actually has a lot of it has a lot of the same ideas in it than that 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 uh, other something taupe, whatever it was, the rabbit Bio, one we biotopes? just looked. Bio biotopes, yeah. bio something like that. Yeah, it has a lot of the same concepts and ideas, you know. Mm -hmm. Like this sort of the framing of it with the shadow. Yeah. And then the different depths being layered on top of one another. Right. I love the fog between the hills that you're hiking, and then the mountain in the mm. background. Like I. All right. Let's I see like who wins. I don't that care. That portals though. <laughs> yeah. Woo, sorry, Trailblazers. That Trailblazers got robbed in the first round by Portals. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. All right. Yeah. We played the next two games, or you played one, and I played the other. Well, yeah, I think you all played the other. Anyway, played Stranger Things. Oh, that's such a good cover. The Upside How Down, I think it's called. And then oh. against World Wonders. That's funny. I know y'all love the World Wonders cover, and I'm very lukewarm on it. But I, I think that Stranger Thing just, oh, man. That is a really good theme. cover. I love that it's, like, movie adjacent, but they didn't go with, like, movie stills or pictures. It's still a, its own artistic representation of it, you know? So you see the, the TV series in it, but it stands alone. The, the reflection, I, they nailed that cover. I absolutely love it. I like that a lot. I mean, I think, I think the Stranger Things is the better one. But I like the World Wonders cover. I do like the, the features in it. Breaking the border is a really nice touch. Like yeah. the mountains come up off the border there, the structure in the front goes outside the frame. And had they tried to put the title in the picture, it would have been out of place. You yeah, know, so I mean, they yeah, did a good yeah. job the way they framed it. Yeah, but yeah. it's but this good. Is... It's very nice. I like the other one better. Also, I don't know if maybe the stone top and bottom on World Wonders might be robbing it of a little more. Maybe just real estate to shine I feel like in a board meeting I would not downvote world wonders but I would also not be like that's it that's fire let's go with that you know stranger things absolutely I would I'm pretty sure stranger things has won let's see indeed it has stranger all right next we're jumping to a game that we don't have here at the studio actually nightmare cathedral against the John Declare Empire's End so this is a tough one because that Nightmare Cathedral, like as a single piece, is a spooky, scary, yeah. mm -hmm. cool looking game. I've seen I've seen some of this artwork online and it is wow, really creepy, yeah. 
There's something about it that like screams H.R. Uh, Geiger to me or something. You know, it's got that really disturbing life form feel. But the other one, the other cover, I really like. She's in this burning city, and then she's looking back, and there's that square of what it once looked like. I really like that. Oh, I didn't get that. That's a, now that you describe it, I'm like, oh, I see that now. Yeah, it's but neat. Before, I, I, I wonder I if the square was... is hard. Like, the edge of the square does not imply portal, does not imply anything. I have no idea why. I think it would be better as almost a thought bubble, like a cloud. Yeah. There needs to be, like, ripped page or something. Yeah. Like, the transition is meaningless. I think so. I think this would look better without the title because you could see a little bit different. Like, I didn't immediately look at this and be like, oh, this is a portal or a memory or something like that. I just, it just ended up looking busy to me. It makes more sense physically, like on the box, by the way. Yeah, that's true. It's easier to see when you see the box. But I think, yeah, Nightmare Cathedral has this. Yeah, don't mention Nightmare Cathedral looks me. like a, a record album. It definitely <laughs> does. Oh, yeah, man. I'm listening to Nightmare Cathedral! That's heavy metal mm. right there. All right, let's see who won. Nightmare Cathedral. I want to play that. Hmm. All right, next we have Jamie Stegmeier's game, Stonemeyer Games Expeditions, against a small little game called Run. Oof. So this is this is taking very minimalistic art and a very distinctive art style that Tim Fowers puts in almost all his games mm -hmm. against more scythe artwork with expeditions. I thought Oof. I remember you saying you didn't like the artwork in expeditions as much as scythe. Is it not yeah, the same? I don't think I said that. It's the same stuff. This I is thought all... you said it looked like they were focusing in on stuff in expedition. That's not on the box. So I don't remember, the Tom, maybe. Um, I know it's all existing artwork. That's the thing about this stuff. This is all a bunch of artwork that, it, that I mean, these games, both scythe and this, Kind of a scythe, especially, was inspired by this person's artwork. That then, actually, that same artwork is in a video game I happen to have on Steam. It's oh, actually really? that lady and that bear are the characters in the video game. Oh, that's really interesting. And here, there's no connection to that. That just happens to be an image for the cover, right? You're not her. Uh, maybe you weren't. Oh, the you can be her in the bear. Yeah. yeah. But like in this video game, Iron. Harvest is what the game is called. Iron Harvest 1930. You are her. And she has a bear companion. And it uses this artwork for transition screens, basically. Loading screens. I like this, but I think I like Run better. Do I, you really? I do. Mm. It's just that I look at that and I'm like, ooh, that just makes me want to play that game. No, I like Expeditions better. Yeah, I still love that style. That that realistic style with touches of supernatural or, mm -hmm. or fantastical. I still love that. All right, let's see what we have. Oh, it's closer. It is fairly yes, close, though. yeah. All right, our last qu quarter here, we have Bonsai, about building a bonsai tree against Couture. Oh. Well, this one, my choice think, is Bonsai. Well, I, I think really I'm like team that. Couture. But I like Couture too, but I, I especially like how her dress fades into white. But Bonsai, I don't know. It gives mm. you that peaceful nature of a tree. It does. And I like how it's very forefront and that there's still a little bit happening in the background, uh, but kind of faded out. I really like, I like that cover a lot. But I, there's something about the Couture with the line work. It feels fashion, you know? I mean, it looks like a fashion student drew this out. She's you know, a like Christmas the present, but yes. And I, yeah, I just... I like I this one this way more. really, Couture? really good. I'm, I get it. I get why... I get... And then the ink splatters down there, you know, as they were... Like, there's just so many little things. The more I look at that cover, the more I like it. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's, that's an excellent cover. Usage of space is wonderful. Yeah. The color, and again, the, how little of it there is, is wonderful. The shades of blue gray, you know, I That's love that. It's really very minimalistic, good. but still feels complete. Like, I, yeah, I really like Couture a lot. All right, let's see what people say. Oh, Ooh, wow. There you go. Yeah. This is the first one, actually, I disagree with. Well, I agree. I like Bonds. I disagree. Yeah, you agree. <laughs> All right, the next two games are very different. 
Uh, Animals Against Space, Life of the Amazonias, and Station Fall. Oh, actually, Ooh. never mind. There's an animal in Station Fall that's a, that's a chimp in that suit. Ooh. I don't like Station Fall. You don't wow. like one of them? You don't I either. don't like that. Station Fall is a horrible cover. I really don't like Station Fall. Why do you think that's a bad cover? Because of that weird, like, creepy monkey hand coming yeah. at me like a Goosebumps book thing. Yeah, I, I don't like It's think awful. <laughs> This is an awful cover. It I don't think like, that's awful. I this, think it looks fine. The spaceship is like almost photo, and the fire is like almost realistic looking, and then the monkey is just out of place. Yeah, I, I, I very much dislike that cover. Station Fall is... All right, now let's go look at the, the giant much. parrot. But I mean, the parrot is also like, oh, it's a big parrot. Like, it doesn't interest me. I agree. You know, I don't like, like either, but eh. that other one is I actively dislike. I, same boat. Same boat. I would go... Life on the, of the Amazonia, just because it doesn't turn me off. All right. <laughs> What's your pick before we see it? Station Fall. I yeah, think it's okay. a cool oh, cover. Right, right. I like it. Oh. I like what it's going for. I, I know it's a chimp. I call Oof. chimps monkeys sometimes. And I know chimps are monkeys, accurate. okay? But not every monkey is a chimp. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Station Fall, but it was Oof. close. All right. Every human is a person, but not every person is a human. Ooh. We have one of my favorite covers up next. We just reviewed oh. this one. We'll be reviewing it this week, actually. Uh -huh. uh, Redwood against oh, Hoplomachus. These are Victorum. Victorum. Both really good. Redwood, everything coming out of the camera there, I love that. That's just such a great Oh, I, I just, I just understood camera. that. Yeah, I didn't I didn't. It's a lens. That. Got it. Yeah. And you're taking pictures oh. of the fars. I think that... Okay, that that's, makes a lot more sense when you explain it. Yeah, yeah, that's one of my favorite covers of the year. I just think it's fantastic. I like the cover anyway, but I think yes, yeah, knowing now that it's that lens, I like it more. At the same time, that's, that's such a grandiose, glorious cover there. Mm. It feels victorious, you know what I mean? Like it does, just like ha. Ah, unless very of course empowering. that unless that guy city is the one underneath the volcano, then it's not as glorious. He's watching like <laughs> I cannot do anything. Yeah, this is a. I mean, for me, it's not necessarily tough, Redwood, but I feel bad for Victorum because I think that's a good I don't know. Cover. I think I like it a lot now that you told me it's the camera lens, but it kind of does take away from it that you had to tell me it was a camera lens. I've looked at that cover multiple times, not really intensively, but sitting on the shelf and that kind of stuff, and it's just now hitting me that it's a camera lens. And I, I just, I like the energy that comes with Victorum. But Redwood represents the game. Oh, it represents the game. See? But I was told not to consider that, so... <laughs> no, yeah. Let's see who won. <laughs> Redwood. Good. Good choice, everybody. <laughs> I mean, you can pick what you want. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next two big giant games. One, Scarface 1920. Okay. And the other, Sleeping Gods Distant Skies. Ooh. Both of these are very nice covers. Scarface, that was like one of your anticipated games for this year, I think. Um, I think so. This I, I really was do my like number one. It just came in yesterday. Finally. Oh, man. Yeah, both of these are very nice. I don't care about that one. It's one of those I can see. I can be like, oh, if someone told me they like that one, I'm like, oh, okay, I can see that. But it's not, I, I don't care for it. Yeah. I don't like the cartoony, then the bottom, it looks. Um, Kind of comic booky, and I don't like that mix of the two. Those two styles match to me. They, they match, both... but I don't want them in the same. I, I don't know. I, I don't feel like. It almost looks like a cartoon, but this one, yeah. just that pterodactyl chasing the plane. That's cool. I just like that. It's very epic. It's. It just, I can almost smell it and feel the cold air. You know, it's very well done. And also, it's like, but what's in the fog? You know, it leaves you <laughs> wanting to know more. Like, a I bigger want bird to that will know. come out and eat that yeah. one. If Sleeping I know God's... my movies correctly. Yeah, George Lucas said, watch out for the bigger fish. Yeah, Sleeping Gods definitely draws me <laughs> in. And like I said, with a scar face, I, I, I like half the cover. Which right. half, though? The bottom. So Scarface, that wasn't even close. <laughs> That's what you get for being oh, only no. half a cover. Apparently. That's going to be a cover showdown in the next round. Okay, now we have a game from Panasaurus. I think it's from Panasaurus. Emerge yeah. against another Vincent Dutre, the art Ooh. project. Ooh. So Emerge has a very 
man, I like Emerge a lot, but then I look at next to Art Project, I'm out. Art That's, Project is one of my favorite covers also. I was drawn, I wanted to play Emerge based on this art cover. It's, I absolutely love it, but I, I'm with you. Art, the Art Project blows it out of the water. I think that his artwork elevates this game, actually. Yeah. I Beyond agree. what I, I would agree. normally yeah. have picked. Be just by the way, we're also playing this one next week, Art Project. Oh, that's exciting. Um, yeah, it's an excellent dynamic cover, yeah. Like each of those characters has a story behind them, and I don't know, it doesn't really have much to do in the game, but Vincent brought those out yeah. in, this, in this game. I like it a lot. Mm -hmm. It's a little busy to cover, though, maybe. It is very busy, actually. It is. But it kind of works for the dun 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 dun, like the team of, you know. But something about like the strips of color, it's very busy, but the strips of color kind of give you that focal point and help me organize it mentally as I'm looking at it, I guess, you know, and I really like that about it. It's a weird shaped box, that's what it, it is. It is. That's the shape of the box. It's this skinny yeah. tall thing. And that's got to be hard to illustrate for. Yeah. A stack of artwork, you know what I mean? Right. Yeah, he did it well. Mm -hmm. All right, that's who gets it. Oh, that's really Ooh, close. Wow. That's close. Okay. Wow. But again, I mean, Emerge, I think, is also a gorgeous cover. It's like, a good I, cover. Yes. This is another hard first-round matchup. I think both could have gone to round two. All right, against we have now Halloween. two games here. A peaceful game against a... An evil game. War game. War game? Ooh. Oh, you messed up, A.A. Yeah. Ron. Here we go. With Earthborn Rangers... Which was the war game? No, I said war. Anyway, war style. Thunder Road is all about fighting with the cars. That is not a war. You're, somebody's writing an email so hard right now. <laughs> Dear Mr. Vassal. With two S's. They always spell my name wrong when they're angry. Correct, yeah. Thunder. I like both these cars a lot. Earthborn Rangers, the fact that that cover is brown makes it stand out a bit. The artwork is, it feels like it was done on a brown paper bag. It does, very it much so. It feels like that a yeah. little bit, doesn't it? Doesn't it kind of have like a weird I finish? Felt anyway. It. I don't know, I haven't picked it up. This is, there's something so old timey about it, but the game is actually futuristic. Yeah, right? it's like, like it's set I in think the future, so. Post -apocalyptic. It seems like that. It's a cool. It's idea. very cool, but Thunder Road Vendetta, yeah, man, the energy amazing. it brings, the chaotic nature of it. I love the focal point of the one car, and then the darker ones in the background. You just feel like they're creeping up on you. Like this has so much energy and mayhem behind it. I, I adore it. This I might really like this one. Be my favorite cover of the year. It would really? be top yeah. three for me. Yeah, yeah. top, I'm, I'm top there. two. Then I'm gonna up <laughs> you one. It's my favorite. <laughs> No, I, I, that might easily be my favorite cover of the year. I do like Earthborn Rangers a lot, though. Well, let's see who won. I think this one's. I think you say, yeah, I think it's a blowout, but I would think, oopsie. Yeah, well, not as big as I thought, but that's yeah. I a mean, pretty, that's over 100 votes, yeah. Thunder. Thunder. Blam, right. blam, bling, 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 blam, blam, bling, bling, bling. Next we have Eos against Evenfall. I do not like Eos. Oh, you don't like that? Well, that... I like the game. I do not like that cover at all. I, I remember that from the Kickstarter, and I was like, what is that wing? Thing? Oh, it's an angel, and it I have to remind myself. It has a look to it. And I feel like it, it's one type of drawing. I don't like the EOS, the actual game title in it. I don't like the way that was artistically done. I, I don't, I like elements of the, co the cover, but I don't like it as a whole piece together. I really, really like Evenfall. So this one is not even close to me. Like, not even close. I agree. I agree. I'm yeah. actually going to also agree, unfortunately. This one is just... I liked EOS. I just think <laughs> Sorry, it has a it's unique. so painful. I know. It is disgusting to have to agree. <laughs> I, I apologize. <laughs> Top three. It is hard to agree with the two of you when you're on a rampage. <laughs> um, I will tell you this. My favorite thing is in, in EOS, if we can zoom in on the little crab, Kicking somebody's butt on the on the lighter side. What? Right there. Look okay, at it. He's adorable. going like, ah, oh, screw your I, ship. I really, <laughs> <laughs> I really like the water. Guy. I really like the way the water is done in EOS, but uh, and then and the ship. But is the angel I, thing throws you off because it's how... the angel and it's the game title. That angel looks like, like it's part of the logo, and then you look closer and you go. Oh no! It's like a, it's like a it's a creature it like, flying there. Yeah, it it just ugh. I don't like the way it goes. But even fall, just the, it feels like I don't know, like a 
seance or something, you it's know? It's just very like the surreal. tree. Yes, yeah. It's very mystical. And then I think the logo with all the little tendrils on them and stuff is just Yeah, I don't like gorgeous. the EO's name, unfortunately. All right, let's see. Let's see who even fall one. Oof. Oh. Well, that's a... Uh, that's pretty nasty beating, yeah. All right, and our last matchup here. Right. Both space games. A lot of space this year. Yeah, there was wow. a lot of space. Evacuation, Evacuation. against Galileo Project. Hmm, one of these is good. I don't know which one you one even think that. I think they're both good. good. I like the colors of Galileo better. One also, I like the artwork of Galileo. It's that whole paper folded stuff. Origami? Oh, is he the, no, the it looks like uh, it looks like um, what is that called? Um, anyway, that geometric look mm. on the planet. I'd lean towards Galileo, but I don't care for either. Yeah, I find the evacuation cover pretty pedestrian. Looks a little like the other one. I think is a nice. You know what is that like? idea? It's a it's a good cover. Yeah. It's fine. It's a neat concept. It looks cool. Very epic. They tried for, they 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 tried for something. I actually do like it. Yeah. The other one is like, yeah. I think ships. I like the background of evacuation, but I don't like the ship. I think that's what it is that throws me off. I don't I don't love it. Galileo, I would ask questions about. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Let's see who wins. <laughs> Galileo. Galileo. Magnifico. All right, round one is done. Let's get this next one started right away. So now we see right. the winners from this first round go up against other winners. That yes. is correct. <sighs> That's how tournaments work. Welcome to sports. What? I said welcome to sports. Thank you. Well, there's a lot less people having their weekends ruined by this, I hope. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you, if, the this, if my pick doesn't right win, now. my weekend will be ruined. All right, well, we're going to jump right into this. I have a lot this. of money riding on this tongue. After us, yeah. it's fighting Darwin. <laughs> the apes are coming after Darwin. Yeah, well, it's a fight for evolution, for, you know, the, the survival of the fittest. I know you're going to disagree with me here, but I nod towards Darwin's journey in this. You're wrong. Thank you I for said playing. You disagree. Don't <laughs> ever so express an opinion Why are again. You so rude? One of them has monkeys. Three questions, yes. <laughs> okay. The only thing better than monkeys, donkeys. Uh, I don't know. I just like that one. Just feels um, challenge about there dated, and monkeys and donkeys. I guess. Not game. dated, like game dated. I mean, it feels like from that time. You know, kind of in the same way, like genotype. You know, it gives that... Oh, you mean it looks like a period, like the, the period, the period yeah, piece yeah, kind like of a period vibe piece to it? Thing, and I like After it us a lot. for me. Yeah, but I know. I think I'm, I'm going to lose this one. Boy. But yeah, I, I nod towards Darwin's journey. Both of these are very nice. What we got? Ooh. Oh, that's actually close. Okay. That's All real right. close. That's really right. close. <sighs> well, these should get closer as time goes by. Right. No, I disagree. Yeah. All right, now we're jumping to Waterfall <laughs> Park oh, okay. against Primal Awakening. <sighs> this is, that's it. Primal Awakening got a little bit of a pass during that first round. I think it's done. I, I, think, I think this is, I would choose Primal Awakening, but I, I think you're right. I think it's out. I think it goes away here. But I, I really like the um, soft focus, the limited color palette of that. Water Park, Waterfall Park is just fun. So, you know, so anyway, so I think I think Primal is out, but that would be my choice. Okay. I'm just getting a little tired of white backgrounds on box set. The first couple times, like, that's neat. Now I'm like, But this eh. one does it well when it's, like, fading out. It's like, is it foggy? Is it just a focal point? It just, I, I like it, yeah, a lot better. Did you run into troubles with the Kickstarter and have to save ink? I mean, what is it? <laughs> like, we, <laughs> there's, like, a little, uh, ran out of money here, right by the tail. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what do we got? Who won this? Mm -hmm. Waterfall Park. All right. Now we go to Fit the Print newspaper, but you can't print when you have no light. Last light. I get it. Uh, um, oh, I'm sorry. I had to delete from the There we go. Oh. These are so different. I think Last Light, for some reason to me, looks better when it's not near other games. I don't know how to explain it. 
when like it its stands own. on its own, it's like mm. you look at it, you're like, that's really cool. Next to fit the print, it looks more black. Also, the yeah. you can't see the embossing. Um, there's embossing on the cover, I think, right? Like that, those are silver lines instead of white. They're shiny, right? Yeah. I'd still pick it over Fit the Print. I don't love the anthropomorphic animals in Fit the Print. I don't know. Yeah, I think I, I'm i fine on either of these. I think I'd nod towards Fit to Print. But again, I like that newspaper background, subtly understated. Um, but yeah, I, I... I like the animals in Fit to Print. I do. It's a weird anthropomorphic thing. But again, they, there's some... That they look like quality. In the quality, and again, it looks like woodblock artwork, or like it makes me think rabbit. of like illustrations in like popular mechanics from the fifties. It has that yeah. style. Yeah, yeah. The rest of the composition around those critters, I'm not so sure about. Interesting. Okay, and I like that balance of it. Again, it's Ian O'Toole, so that makes sense. Yeah, it's, it's okay. Yeah, the, all right. Let's see what we got. He's really good too. Yeah. All right. Last light, but it was not necessarily a blowout. All right, let's see. Well, now we have a weird matchup of philosophy against mm, like Voidfall. Oh, it's a hard oh. choice. Oh, look, look. If you look at the Voidfall cover, that, that one, like if you zoom in on the lower left hand corner, Roy, it's the cover for evacuation. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't need to zoom in, right? You We're see what fine. I'm saying? It's true. It's like the bottom quarter of that, you know, on the left there is, is evacuation cover. It's so much better. Yeah, it is. I think I, I, I really love philosophy, but I think I go Voidfall in this one. Yeah, I like Voidfall uh, better. Gosh, it just, and it stands oh. out. It's like, oh, and it's a space game. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's, there's so few of them that I like, and so it just stands out in that and as well. So it's just a gorgeous piece of art. I think philosophy, the reason also is philosophy goes a little bit neon. I, I don't know. I I can go either way. I don't know. I, I feel like I'm talking myself into either pick here. I don't know. I'll be happy with either one. Let's Not see me. Well, if, you, if the right choice isn't made, go. you're safe today. There it is. <laughs> Voidfall. <laughs> All right. Now we're moving to Arborea against Ice. 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 I go Ice. Easy. I already was not on board the Arborea one too much. It won against what Halloween? Yeah. Yeah, Ice is a better. No, it won against Nova Roma, which you oh. did not like. Yeah, well, oh, okay. Ice beat Halloween. Okay. Oh, okay. Ice <laughs> is the more interesting one of these two. It's got a really engaging, claustrophobic vibe. Mm. It's the the title is looks fantastic on that cover. Yeah. The typography is excellent. They knocked it out of the park. I like the Arborea. The graphic design here is fantastic. Yeah. I like Arborea, but Ice is a, like an iconic cover. Mm -hmm. That just it is, looks yeah. great. Ice is cool. Let's see. <laughs> Ignore Z more often. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, Whoa! wow. That is oh. easily the biggest blowout so far. Goodbye, <laughs> Critters of the Forest. Oh, my <laughs> word. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. Next, we're having Planet Nuba. Go up against Beast. I don't think Beast can take this, right? I mean, I'm, I, I, I don't know which way they'll go, but I'm, I'm very much Beast on this. Like I said, oh, Planet, really? Planet, like Planet, New, Planet Nuba, nothing sticks out to me. Nubo, I think, Nubo. I think if I look closer, and it's one I had it in person, maybe, but, but like just looking at these images, I, <laughs> I'm very much Beast. It just looks like. A farming game, maybe? I don't know. There's cities in the trees. Yeah, what are you talking about? It's amazing. But Beast has a better way of integrating its title in. That just looks cool. It looks cool. I like the orange they went with on that, that yeah. nice burnt orange. I like Planta Nubo better. Though well, I'm happy with either. I find it either. pretty generic, I think, is how I would. Planta Nubo. I don't know who won this me. one. Let's find out. That's the closest yet. Yeah, it is. Let it sit for a second. But I mean, everybody's voting correctly right now. <laughs> by, I mean, I by everybody, I mean half of you. Yeah, if you're like all, like you're like you're in mid, you know? Yeah. Okay, it's disgustingly no. close. Oh, <laughs> beep, 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 beep. <laughs> oh man. 
We're at 86 versus 80 right now. It's very, very close. There's just something. They yeah. have not switched yet, though, Tom, since we started looking at them. No, they were. Plant Anubo was on top of yeah, first. Yeah, Plant Anubo was yeah, on top. Yeah, they did switch. No, no it was... <laughs> Oh, yeah, you're right, because it's trash. It definitely was never on. All right. Oh, they switched on. already. No, wait, wait, I'm say, sorry. No, I didn't realize no, no, no. that the colors. <laughs> oh. He was ready switched. to call it when his guy it was, was on the yeah, top. Yeah, he's like, oh, yeah. Oh, I see. <laughs> yeah, no, I was definitely on Plant Anubo, and I did not realize they, had, they, got, they got to 50 and switched. Yeah, I like Plant Anubo better. I'm calling it. Better. It's 10 ahead. Yeah. Beast takes it. Oh, you people. You disgusting you people. You did well, people. You did well. All right, next we have <sighs> Nature versus Nucleum. Nucleum against La Grania. God, I'm sorry, I know. Gosh. Hmm? It's Nucleum. Okay. Is it? No, I don't think so. <laughs> don't ask me words. Okay, one of these is really good. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they're both by the same company, so you can say whatever you want. Oh, good. Nucleum is a piece of garbage. Oh, I disagree. Cover-wise, <laughs> I've never played the game. I like Nucleum a lot, and I know I stuck up for it, but I think these two next to each other, Legrand Haas is, is, is lovely compared. I, w I can't tell if that's dismissive or not. No, Which it's lovely. Like it's lo I think I, I would vote Legrand Haas because it's lovely, but I don't, Nucleum I still really, really like. I, again, I, like, I spoke about the energy. <laughs> I just love what it brings, but these two compared, I think the nod goes to Legrand Haas. All right. Well, let's, yeah, that's my nod as well. Let's see if that is correct. Indeed, yeah. it was. Like Granada. All right, last from our first half, we have La Familia against Daybreak. This one I'm feeling okay. is kind of going to be a slam. I don't know if it's a slam dunk because you and I, I like you and I like it. I don't think people like it generally that this much. This is a yeah. slam dunk Daybreak for me. Really? Uh, for me, for me personally, like it's a slam dunk for I yellow mean, and green. And I, what do you like about that cover? Of the Daybreak? Yeah, yeah. I just, I like the blocky covers. I feel like there's a lot of movement, too. It just feels, you, you feel that long path, like, drawing you in, you know? And I just like how blocked the colors are. It's very kind of fragmented and uses um, uses that really well. So I, I like that. La Familia, and, and again, he is one of my Even favorite, the, favorite yeah. artists. This is probably my least favorite cover, cover of, of his. his. Yeah. Of his. And he is, he is top three for me, but I don't care for La Familia. Yeah, gosh, that cover for Daybreak just looks like it's nice art, but I expect that that on like on a pamphlet. I should say you can make a better future. <laughs> yeah, bottom, it's like right? See, solar panels, lady on a bike, wind turbine. It screams pamphlet to me. See, in La Familia, it seems like that, you know... A pamphlet to burn houses? No, it seems like oh. that one that you're in, like an art museum, and everyone's standing around looking at it, and you're like... That is the one that's... Okay, I would be there, but I'd be giggling. I'd be like... <laughs> like <laughs> see, but there are other ones that have... They feel like that Easter egg. Like, my eyes just, like, move past that, and I don't care. It, and if you point out the burning house and the baseball bat and this and that, and I'm like, oh, yeah, you're right. That's this there. But it doesn't feel like an Easter egg because I wasn't drawn to look at it more. I, I, I don't think it's an Easter egg. Quickly, it's, it's, let's see who I won I very quickly this. move on past it. Oh, you're wrong. Woo! La Familia. All right. In our wonderful, other bracket, a wonderful cover. More it's burning houses. I dogs. Say. It's not dogs versus dogs. It's dark. It's Bark Age. Oh no, Bark, Bark Avenue. Avenue. Sorry, I can't read my. Bark, Bark Age is a great. I like that. This should be a thing. Bark, Bark Age. Avenue against yeah. perspectives. The Bark Ages were a, a, an evil time. I like these both, but I'm gonna I'm gonna vote for perspectives because it's just so. Cool. Has anybody played perspectives? Do we have it? It's Matthew Dunstan. I really want to try it. I don't think we have it. I know, but I want to play it. Is what I'm saying. I can't mm. tell if you want to play it or not. I want to. I want to play this one. I don't like either of these covers. Oh. I, I would not vote. One of them this. has doggies. I can't believe Camille right. just voted down a dog cover. I don't care for the cover. I I, I love the perspective. What's your thing but against dogs? It. Oh she my god. Really dislikes dogs secretly. Wow. Mom stole my word. <laughs> Make eye contact again. See. <laughs> what kind of dog is that dog? Which one? The one on the uh, left there that's bright yellow. Oh, it's a cab. It's <laughs> 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 a dumb joke. I know. My word. I know. Uh, let's I see understand. who won. <laughs> uh, yeah, oh, perspectives. Wow. Yay. <laughs> All dogs have been eliminated. All right. Now we have, this is funny, <laughs> Sail versus Maps. Sail versus Maps uh, of Mystera. 
Ooh, both, both, both really of these good are covers. really pretty, yeah. Yeah. I'd be happy. Sales my 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 pick of the two, but <sighs> Oh man, it really suffers from this comparison, I gotta it say. Does. These two would be top top oy, five. For oy, me. Oy. Easy, easy. These are some of my favorites of the year, but I'll nod to sale because that's might be my favorite. I can see year. Maps winning this one though, though uh, between these two. I agree. Again, that is gorgeous. <laughs> I mean maps it would be right up there next to this one. Oh, it's so good. Yeah, these are both really, really good. I think Maps of Mystera, purely again, the cover. That's the fantastic cover. But Sale just has that old world it's very feel bold. It's with very being bold and bold iconic. Yeah. And I just, oh. They're both it's good. what I want La Familia to be. All right, let's see what we got here. I'm curious. Will this be close? Wow. Indeed it mm. is. Sales winning, but just by a smidge. Mm. Oh. Getting a little bit more, yeah, yeah. Wow, oh, gosh, really... but that maps too, like, oh, I, I, so good. So close. This one hurts to have it kicked yeah, out. Yeah, this yeah, one, yeah, this either one, one. This is the first one that I'm like, oh, that hurts. No, I take that back, Trailblazer. That one hurt too, because of the comparison. <sighs> All right, I think I'm going to call this one here. Oh. Are you? <laughs> it's tense Your right now. Your bias is showing. No, I'm, not, I'm trying not to. I was about to, I, if my bias was showing, I would have called it already. First one to 100. <laughs> <laughs> now it, it looks like it's it's settled there. It All hasn't right. switched at all. Sale. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, Maps. You can play in a loser's bracket. We're not doing a loser's bracket. Oh. All right. Next, we have Portals against. Stranger Things Upside Down. Oh, you're killing me. Okay, I'm Stranger Things, so I think I just, that that was when you said this list, this is the first cover I thought of. Really? Wow. It's the Stranger like Things ones. I absolutely, I was They so, share a lot of colors, these two covers. They do. They do, that's interesting, yeah. Um, but no, I, I love, again, that Upside Down with the Demogorgon in the background. It's reminiscent of the TV show, but also has artwork that stands out on its own. Mm. I love the, the red top and the blue bottom. It's just, it's so iconic. This, like I said, first cover I thought of for Best of 2023. If you took the titles out, I think Stranger Things is better. But when you add the titles in, Portals comes out ahead for me. Oh, I think that's the Portals interesting. title works better. The Stranger Things, I know they have to use it. It's from the TV show. Right. But if they, it's a uh, very well more. done logo. Their Stranger Things title is also their logo. It's really good. That Portals cover, though, wow. It is really good, too. That is an yeah. amazing cover. That's my pick. We haven't got Portals here, right? Is the Portals even out? I don't know yet. Mm, I don't know. I have not seen this in person. All right. Yeah. Let's see who wins. I have no idea. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. I'm not surprised by that one. Like I think I, I figured wow. I was in the minority of that one, but yeah, it Netflix doesn't change haters? me. But no, no, it has nothing to do with the show. The but, um, was coming to but it's also Prime. a fire one. Amazon Prime. <laughs> that's what it is. All right, I'd watch a show called Portals. Portals. All right, all right. We got Nightmare Cathedral now against Expeditions. Interesting. I saw a lot of hate for Expeditions earlier when we were reading the comments. So I wonder if if this is it for it. I don't know. That Here's cathedral the cover is very. It's, it's, there's something unnerving about that cover. There's something mm. about it. I just like I, I kind of want to look away, and I can't. It feels it like is. a castle made of flesh. There's something very disturbing about it. Again, H.R. Geiger is what keeps coming to mind. It's one of those things I, I keep talking about, like, if an art piece pulls you in to have you still, or box cover, I mean, to keep looking at it and see the details, and that's what Nightmare Cathedral is. I want to look. I just can't pull away from it, and I love that about it. It just draws me in and holds me. I really, really think, like that a lot. Expeditions is, is good, and I think I, I like, think I like Expeditions, the piece of art, thematically better. But as far as like the two next to each other, I'm I'm full court Nightmare Cathedral. I think I would have liked Expeditions more if Side didn't exist. If that makes sense, mm -hmm. I feel like I've seen this before, but I don't know. Let's see who wins. I have no idea. Idea. Oh wow! Very nice. Yeah, I was yeah. not expecting that. 
to see expeditions go out so early. I am surprised too. Like, yeah, that's interesting. I thought this was one I'd be in the minority with. So. All right, well, maybe this next one will make you guys happy. You get rid of the cover you both hate for some reason. Bonsai against Station Fall. Oh, done. <laughs> Let's not, no, just show the results now. Though. Let me just tell you. You can't show the results if we haven't put them up yet. I've decided the results yet. are. <laughs> Which one is this? The monkey one? Yes, this is the really bad one that made it. Remember that one? Both of these I thought lost. Uh, Bonsai lost to... Couture. Couture. Which I thought was much better. Yes. And then Station Fall lost to... But oh, they both won, just as a heads up. You mean Sorry, oh, they yeah. both won to... The Amazon They're is... Yeah, I thought yeah. the, the and I don't like either one of those, Station Fall or, or the Amazonia Bird, but I thought the pair should have taken it, and I definitely thought Couture was better yeah. than Bond. It does not I matter agree. who wins this, they will lose in the next they're, round. They're so yes, just, but they, they should have lost they earlier, we that's shouldn't the even, point. Yeah, this like is a Bonsai. waste of I don't think it's cruel to give that monkey hope. <laughs> <laughs> I do like, you I do like Bonsai out, more. Close the window. <laughs> All right. It's got to be Bonsai, it's, right? It's got to be, come on. Yes. Okay, I was like, if not, they're just being contrarian. <laughs> like, they don't have to listen to you two. What are you talking about? I think the one I said should win should win. <laughs> Otherwise, why are we doing this? All right, well, now we have a really tough choice here. Okay. Redwood versus Sleeping Gods, Distant Skies. Oof. I'm Distant Skies. I feel like, I'm, I feel like this shouldn't be a top 32. This should be a final eight battle. But I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, same, yeah same yeah. as the other ones, yeah. I think Distant Sky still pulls me in. Again, I want to know what's in the fog. I want to look and see what all is going on and just study that piece. Redwood is very, very pleasing. And I know they said earlier, like, oh, that's a you thing, Camilla. I saw the camera immediately. Yes, well, this entire stream is, you know, our own opinions. No, this whole thing so, is a, this whole stream is a Camilla I like, thing. I was like, yeah, that was, that was a really... Uh, Which was anyway. big. But, but, uh, but yeah, for me, that, that does take away from it. Um, Distance Guy draws me in and wants me... I think I'd pick Redwood, I actually. Yeah. I think I'd go Distant Skies on this one, but they're both really nice. Yes, absolutely. I'll tell you what, that Sit Down logo really hurts. <laughs> the Red Raven is artistic, and, and it does help that he did his own logo, right? Sure. But it, like, fits right in it really well. Yeah. All right, let's see who got this. Woo! Dang, that's wow. close. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, really close. they're four votes apart right now. Three votes apart. Oh, wow. wow. That is insanely close. Wow, wow, wow. This is, yeah, both this of is these the are battle very we good. expect for the last round. <laughs> you yeah, know, or, yeah, or yeah, right. Finals, You're always please. worried that like, the oh. last round turns out to be a blow. That's like watching the Super Bowl. <laughs> wow. Hmm. Three they votes apart. They have been apart. within five votes, like almost the entire time. Yeah. Oof. All right. You, you said wow. redwood, Tom. You liked redwood better. Yeah, but barely. Right. I mean, I don't care. That's. I think I, I felt not pretty strongly on Sleeping Gods, but um, it was not okay, this close. Okay, they're tied right <laughs> now. Oh! And Sleeping Gods so is on top by two votes All now. Right. Yeah, I like Sleeping Gods better myself. Yeah, uh, they're anyway. both very good, but I like it better. Oof. They switched again, and they switched again. Wow. What do you do? If it's a tie, then we break the tie. There's three of us. We can't, it can't be a tie. What if I don't so, vote? So Sleeping Gods <laughs> wins. <huh? laughs> then my vote counts as two. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. Can they only vote once? Can people only vote once? Yeah, How well, does this well work? yes, probably. But if you want, okay, I'm, 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 like, I'm calling it Sleeping Gods. It, it's it's a few votes ahead there. Can one of those swap out with Bonsai? <laughs> oh <my laughs> well, whichever one wins here goes up against Bonsai next time. So that'll be an interesting oh, perfect. battle. There we go. So all right, okay, here's a hard one for you, Z. Yes, go. We have the Art Project. Oh, 100 percent against oh. Thunder Road Vendetta. That one, 100 <laughs> percent. Yeah. No, this is actually not a hard pick. Yeah. I thought I think Thunder Road Vendetta is that much better. It is. It's. I agree. I really like the yeah. artwork in. A lot. Uh, goodbye, everybody. <laughs> <Bye>. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like the art project, the individual stuff a lot, but pure cover. Like if I said, "What's the art in the game?" I might actually pick Art Project over. It's great. The Thunder boards Road. in the Art Project, the cards, everything. It is, yeah. But I feel like because the game has such a weird box size. Vincent Dutrain is kind of making lemonade here with lemons. They're like, here, draw a really tall image, 
show all these characters. He's like, all right, they're getting stacked. You know what I mean? I don't know, because I feel like if this was a little bit wider as well, they could have just brought that yellow color down and it still maintained a really good focal point and balance. So I don't know that the piece of art... I feel like he would have spread those people out. If he had the real estate. Maybe he would have, yeah. No, 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 but no, no. I, don't I think. know he would have. Uh, yeah, right, right. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> Monsieur Dutre, Did Thunder would Road you have But I think Thunder Road is not, I mean, it's not even close for Ooh. me. Yeah, and here as well. All right, Dutre is out again on this one. He's not out completely. He's still in this with one game after us. We'll see how that does. All right, then we have Evenfall against Galileo. Evenfall. Again, doesn't matter who wins no. this. They go up against Thunder Road, but... Oh, these are both very I nice. Like, I really like Galileo. It just feels like a different a different look to it. I like that poly, uh, I'm, polygon I'm, art a lot. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good with Galileo. I'm good with it. But I love Evenfall. I think I give... I like Galileo Project better. Really? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I, I like, like that better. The usage of color, the rainbow thing, the faces in the colors, the planet with, again, that sort of geometric pol polygon thing going on, hmm. fading to, to night sky, outer space at the top. So that kind of looks like uh, the, the Aurora Borealis a little bit at the edge, at the top edge there. Oh, yeah. gosh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I, I Galileo is, is very... Mid mediocre to me. I'm like, oh yeah, that that's nice, you know. And then I move well, on. First Even of all, you fall. need to stop saying mid because. Uh, oh no, I'm making it. It's it's a thing. No, I'm the in kids now. I, made I'm it a thing. Let's in take a look and see what mid. we got here. <laughs> <laughs> but even fall looks like, it's to me Woo! like you were talking about the Everborn, uh, the Ranger one, Everborn, Afterborn, Earthborn, Everborn, Rangers Earthborn Ranger. Yeah. How it was like on a paper bag. Like that's kind of what I get from even fall. But yeah, I, it should be in a paper bag. I would buy that paper in the bag. Discount bin. All yeah, right, well, let's go now. We're going to solve you lost. Let's get our final eight here. All right, first entry to final eight is either going to be... I lost my voice. You lost your voice to the people. ...or Waterfall Park. Oh. That's interesting. Interesting. Uh, similar color schemes here. Both blue. Both cloudy. The apes are going to go play in the roller coasters. We. I think I nod after <sighs> us on this one. Again, what you were talking about in the first round, just the composition of it, I really, really like. Yeah. Ah, gosh. I don't know. I, this is a coin flip for me. I think I would want to see more of the actual park in Waterfall Park. I'd want that, like, blown up a little bit more. Um, unless of the dead space around it, where I like where after us is playing on the dead space and it brings balance for me, so... Mm. I would pick after us because I think there's a story involved in like what happened. Why is the Eiffel Tower broken? Right. Um, why are those apes? Why is that? One, I think that one ape in the middle is like playing with some device. And I really like that they incorporate the Catch Up Games logo into into the cover. It's part of that rock near the front. It's just mm -hmm. like on the rock. Yeah. I really like when companies manage to do that, and it's like, oh, our logo would clash with this. Then make it part of the artwork. Right, exactly. Love yeah, that. make it blend in there. Yeah, sacrifice. Yeah, make it about the game. All right, let's see who's got it. Oh, Dutrait survives to the final eight. What a beast! It's the first time that's happened, I think. All right, now it's space v space. Last light mm. against Voidfall. Ooh. Mm. And here Ooh. I think is where. I might jump off the last light train because I do like that voice. That, those like that mo the monstrous maw thing. There's a few of them, right? Like the one very much in front, and then one back there somewhere. That is so cool. I, I don't know what it is. It's spooky. It's scary. It's it feels terrifying. I love that look of that cover. Yeah, I do too. I've I've been all in on Voidfall from the beginning. I love it. To me, that is the space theme, the space game, the space energy that I want. I, I love it. The lettering, the broken letters. Yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah. is that, is that, um, Ian O'Toole? Is that one of his? Was Have we mentioned I that? I don't know if Voidfall's his. I don't know. Mm. It, it looks amazing. Whoever did the artwork and yeah. the graphic design on that font and that, I mean, this is a slam dunk cover. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, let's see. I, I don't know. Voidfall. All right. Yeah, that is a, that's a tough one. Sorry, Christian. He's watching the artist. Voidfall is Eno 
Is it he going to tool? tool? That, he's well, I guess I take back my thing saying I don't normally like his covers then. Oh, yeah. Huh. His I'm, I'm, covers. He swings for the fences. And you've, a couple of those times, haven't liked some of those swings. Yeah, they just don't yeah. work for me always. He's gone like, oh, I made a cover based on pointillism. And you're like, what? Uh, he does really crazy well, I do stuff. I like pointillism, but yeah, I get it. No, you don't. <laughs> you don't even know what it means, okay? Fine, you do. <laughs> it's the only piece of art I do know. Give me my one uh, term. All right. Ice versus beast. Ice beast. That's what I want to see. This one's hard for me. These are both, these, are, these would both be like, Top seven or eight won't really? be here, yeah, for me. But I don't I, think any of them would be in my top. I you know. don't know how Beast has made it this far. It's a great cover. What are you talking it's about? Fine, so it's a fine cover. No, it is so good. I love that light coming from behind, which kind of fuzz, fuzzes out that like big monster thing. So you're wanting to look more. It, it draws you into this portal. <laughs> you know, I, I absolutely love it. I really like ice, but, but I think I, I'm on beast side now. I, I I could go either way on these, to be, to be fair. Everything I said about beast is not taking away from ice. I like ice as well. Mm. Um, but yeah, I really, really like beast. I, I think, I yeah, I don't know. I think I would nod towards beast. Something about that light and just drawing you in. The monster not being the main, it's called Beast, and the monster is such a big part of this, but it's not the central, central focus. You know, it's in the background more and a little bit blurred out. I just, I love that. All right, let's see. I have no idea who's going to win this one. Woo! Yeah, but I Ice. Ice. Beast is, the Beast has been defeated. <laughs> been slain, okay? <laughs> so you got put in the cooler. All right, and it's other, time to sing. Other dumb jokes. La, 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 la. It's La Grana against La Familia. Oh, okay. Oh, it's La versus La. Oh, man. You know what? If La Familia had a donkey anywhere on that cover, I'd be all over it. Oh, gosh, I don't know. These it's still my both... favorite of the two, but... Which one? La Familia. I, I tell oh. you, I just it's one of my favorite covers of the year, if not my favorite. I think it's fun. But I get the other one, like you said, technically beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> so, La Grana is pleasing. Who is the artist on that one? It's really good art. It is. On like yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, I wonder who the art is. I don't know. Can we, is it on the cover? Roy, is it on the cover? No. No. Yeah, that's a good one. These are both really, really good. I I'm think good like Gran Granha will win, actually. Yeah. That's a gorgeous cover. Is it Ian the two again? No. Oh, it's a non pronounceable one? I'm going to let you read them. It's going to be Spanish, so I'm going to make the Z. Oh! Ho! Oh. Agnieszka Dabrowska and Zbigniew um, Gelter. So, who is ah. winning? Who's winning? Weberson Santiago. Because I don't like Ooh, Familia. Close. No, not that, that close. It's 10 votes apart, but closer. Yeah, these are both really good. Hmm, I disagree. You don't like one of them? Oh, La Familia, you don't like. You can be happy now. It's out. Okay. Finally. Yeah. All right, I'm back in. We're back right. again. Now to the other side. It's, we had our first four. Now we have Perspectives against Sale. Sale. Duh. I agree. I like Sale Duh. better. I think Perspectives is a really neat cover, but I'm sticking on my Sale train. Again, I'm usually Gosh. a fan of that art. It's just That one just bores me. I don't know. I don't know why. These are both really good. You this just might... shot down with Santiago. Now you're back on. Oh no! I've said before, like he's one of my, he is top three artists for me. I love his stuff. That one is easily my least favorite of his. But we don't need to talk about it because it's I'm out. I'm so Sailor intrigued Sam. by Sam. that oh, perspective's God. cover, but is it a party game? I don't know what kind of game it is. I, I don't know. It's no, just that's... a very intriguing cover, but I think Sale is. This is where it. it yeah, I'm done with that's, it. That's that's a good. That that's a good set. You said you're intrigued because of perspectives because of it. I'm not. I think that's what it is. This turns me off the game. I'm like, I don't care to know more. I'm good. You need more curiosity in your soul. No, it needs to give me curiosity. No, uh, it's not how curiosity it's works. Who okay. Me curious. No, 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 it's not how that works. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Yes. Whoa. Excuse yes. me. Again. <laughs> no longer here. curious. These last two rounds have been fire. <laughs> All right. So good. We now have portals. Against uh, Nightmare on Elm Nightmare Cathedral. Oh, <gasps> okay. I think Nightmare Cathedral's done. You really love that Portals cover. I really do. 
I wow. really do. Now, like, you put it next to portals, unfortunately, and uh, it's less scary. all the flaws... But flaws, come to the I front. Like flaws, I think it just does. It's also smaller. It's flat, like that Hold nightmare on. This cathedral. This is rigged. One of the covers is bigger. I'm just saying, <laughs> portals. That's how yes. That works. Yes. Yeah, nightmare <laughs> cathedral is again. I really, really, I've been championing it. Yeah, yeah. You put it next to portals, and you go, "Where's the color? Where's the anything? You know, there's nothing. And maybe that's the point." They're both really cool, but portals is an amazing. I, I, I've been. I think nightmare cathedral is is. Fantastic, and I really loved it. But this is where I think I nod to Portal. I think as that's well. it. Yeah, I'm not knocking you know, it at all. I really, I'm a, I'm a huge champion of yeah. that cover. This, this is a all right, matchup. Let's see who fall. gets it? Yeah. You were yeah. correct, Z. Camilla said it too. That's all right. You said it louder. I'm, I'm. Yeah. I'm. Yesterday's news. Yeah. Wow. All right. Let's take a look at this next matchup. That the next two matchups will go quickly. Bonsai against Sleeping Gods. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. bye. What's bye. next? Bye. Thanks for what else? Me, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I tried to see these. I tried discuss. to see these <laughs> properly, and I, I, it's, it's really hard. I, it's, it's hard to see yeah. stuff. So that well, I think the mistake was putting Bonsai in. You really, you really dislike it that much? No, it's fine. It oh, oh, two you're other being games. dramatic. You're so mad about Couture. Well, yeah, I think. Couture, yeah, yeah I think that's that was, better than Bonsai. Yeah. I, th I think Couture absolutely got robbed. Yeah, uh, that's weird. Like Couture against Distant Skies here would still be difficult for Show me to choose. Show us Sleeping Gods. Hey, wow. Uh, it's I closer think, than I think I some thought. people are voting Bonsai because you're yeah, YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Our next possible <laughs> quote Hashtag contest. Justice, justice for, for Redwood. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Oh my god. Our next two uh, possible right. closes is uh, Evenfall and Thunder Road. Oh, Evenfall. No, like Ooh. a donkey. Oh, this is hard. But I think I do lean Thunder Road Vendetta just again because of the energy it brings. It's just so iconic. Like, it draws me in. I want to know the game. I want to play the game. I want that. Like, I, you, you walk away from that cover feeling excited, and I, I love that. But that's hard for it to say because I do love Evenfall. Yeah, I think but, no, I'm done with Evenfall at this point. Very like done. Thunder Road. In fact, I'll go as far as to say that uh, you so if you put it next to Thunder Road just... Vendetta, all the flaws come out. <laughs> all right, let's see who has this one. <laughs> Oh, it's close. Kind of close. Closer than I thought, actually. Yeah. It's uncomfortably close. Okay. <laughs> you, <were> so, <laughs> you need a Snickers. <laughs> Since yesterday. <laughs> All right, Thunder Road. We have our final eight. Let's now go Let's down go. to the final four. This is what yo, they yo, call yo, the, yo. the big four. The, no, the the, fi the the final four. <laughs> what was the eight thing? What's the eight? The elite. The elite eight. And final four, and then the two some twos. After Us versus Voidfall is our first After match. Us is done. Voidfall all the way, baby. Hashtag Ian O'Toole. Ian O'Toole meets up on Detroit. Is this Detroit's last moment? Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, man. These are both really, really good. I like Voidfall better. I think I go Voidfall, too. That is such a cool game. Is that the one we've got here, you said? That you're scared of opening? Yeah, yeah, we've had it for a chickens. bit. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm going to go open it. To open it. I'm going to open it. No, because that means I have to sort it. I'm going to go open No, I'm going to open it and sort it. Why is everybody scared of this game? No, it's not that we're scared. It's a two-hour sort. I don't mind. Why? I like, love doing that stuff. Why are you guys Sorting, terrified of a like board game? It's a children's play Where thing. does the word terrified come from? You keep, I keep hearing the shaking in your voice. <laughs> we have void fall, <laughs> and I don't want to be the one to open it. <laughs> um, All right, what do we got here? Voidfall and Dutre falls again. Voidfall, our first entry in the final four. Now we have Ice against Lagrand. Ice. You know, when I put these together, I did not expect Lagrand to go to the top. Yeah, right. There. I think it's benefited from matchups. Mm, yeah, Ice, ice is my, my yeah. vote here. I mean, I love. I love donkeys. I'm a, a, a but but we know we haven't heard. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, are, you guys, 
can except me for my donkey love. <laughs> not your, not no. if you say it like you that. Donkey can't. love to yourself. I can't accept nothing. <laughs> In fact, making a note to HR. <laughs> 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 All right. I pick ice. Let's see what happens. Oh! Whoa! Yeah. Wow, people are really loving on this ice. In person, it's a pretty... And it's also a really great production ice. The, yeah. the production is very impressive. All right. Sail versus portals. Now nah, you're... You're picking no. portals, right? No, yeah. You're portals You're all still way. portals? Oh, this is where I feel very strong about sales. Sales. I'm a big fan sales. of sales. So I mentioned in comments, like, wasn't sale last year? Last year when we did this, we did best of all time. And the sale cover had come out already. Okay. That's why. This is just 2023. We'll probably do this every year because I like looking at all the covers from a year. This is where looking at these, too, it's like portals is a little too cartoony, a little too uh, bland. Whereas sale is arguably less artwork, but not. It just brings so much personality with it. So this is where I strongly lean towards sale. Really? Yep. All right, well, let's see. Portals. There you go. Portals whooped up on sale. That's, Boom. I think sale is probably my number one of the year. My personal one. It's pretty close really? for me. Yeah. Now this next one, tough matchup here. Sleeping Gods right. against Thunder Road. Oh, this stinks. This Thunder Road and Dead I still think is a better the color. The more we go, huh? This gets less fun the further we go. <laughs> I have to like start making these cuts. I don't like it. Oh. Yeah, I like Thunder Road Vendetta more. It's that color palette, that fiery, vibrant that, nature yeah. of it. The torn edges, the just mm. sort of oh man. It's incorporated into the cover really well like you said i think when you said the torn edges it's like that kind of hit the nail on the head i i yeah i'm, I'm leaning thunder road vendetta i'm happy Which with hurts. either actually Which they're very hurts. different all right let's see i don't know i think sleeping gods oh mm. thunder road wow. comes out on top all right we have our final four matchup number one for the final four mm. void fall versus Ice. The fonts are kind of similar in this. Oh, interesting. They are. Camilla, Ooh. I'm jumping the Voidfall ship and going to Ice. I might be too, Tom. Because I... the one thing about Gosh. Ice I really like are those two really guys like... climbing down that they... rope in the middle. It's so spooky to me that and they're it, doing that. And it kind of has that geometric feel to it as well. Like um, these look Jack like Galileo part of a had. series almost, right? They kind of, they, 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 there's some, yeah, there's some uh, reverberations here from one to the other. I still like Voidfall better. I think I, I think I lean ice, but I'm, I'm truly okay with either of these. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I haven't seen too much of that detail in ice up close, to be fair. The little people and stuff. I haven't either. No, this is. All right, let's see who wins. The Voidfall <laughs> is just so this striking. Ooh. Oh, that's amazing! I'm I was not expecting that. Right, I'm not opening it anymore. Would, ice comes in all over. Because I would be like, my personal would be like 4951. You know, like I nod one way, but I could have gone either way. I'm surprised that that one's not more. Ice is also uh, was a lot of work to open up and put together. Yeah. It's a lot of work to set it up. But uh, next, and we have Portals against Thunder Road. These are like your top two covers. There I you think. go, one two for you, right? Yeah, I think so. I'm um, really surprised you like Portals that much. I really like it too. No, though. I really, really like it. I'm just surprised like how much. I so I vote Thunder Road Vendetta on this. That Mad Max movie yeah. poster thing. They even have in the bottom there kind of looks like a movie rating box with some information. They made it look like you know you'd see it on a movie poster. Mm. Yeah, it, the it orange brings... and red, and it's like. Just orange and red and, and tan and black. That's it. That's the palette. And how much they're doing with that. Yes. And the, the, the feelings, like, it brings emotion with it. You know, I, I, yeah. It's, the cards are coming at you again, that perspective. Like, yeah, yeah I, I think Thunder Road Vendetta. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, wow. interesting. Wow. Interesting. 
Yeah, Portals is winning right now by quite a bit. I, yeah, yeah. I very much disagree with this one. All right. They're both gorgeous. Wow. Gotta say, I wasn't expecting these two wow. covers to make it to the yeah, finals. Yeah, yeah. All right, here's the wow. final. It is Ice against Portals. I would not have picked these two. They have very some similar circular, compositions. Yeah, very circular covers. Basically, what I'm hearing is people would rather game ship in circular boxes <laughs> rather than box boxes. Get on that, companies. Just I, I like send them in cookie tins. Cookie tins for the win. I think what I like about ice is you talk about it having that circular nature, but then there's things that break that. You know, I don't know if it's stalagmites or stalactites because I haven't thought of that since fourth grade. But there are, you know, those coming out of the bottom that kind of break that circular look that give you kind of that claustrophobic feel. Um, and I really, really like that. So for me, it's I, I lean ice. Oh, you like ice much more? Yes, okay. much more. I like portals more. way more. It, I was I not think, expecting this matchup, but this matchup is easy for I me. No, see, and it's easy for me. I think portals has shown its cartooniness in the last couple of rounds, and that's what's pulling me out of I it. I love that. It looks and like a Netflix series waiting to happen. That my son would watch. Wow. She has called you. No, no, no. I don't. <laughs> Her son, 36. Not you personally. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> All right, I'm going to vote for Ice here, but it's a, it's a tough call. What do we got? All okay. right, closer. All right. Oh, interesting. All right, well, there you go. Ice pulls it off. So a couple things before we... Wait, wait so what is the one, two, three? I, don't, I lost in everything. I... Oh, that was our top two? That was it. Oh, yeah, we're done. What did you think? Yeah, we're done. Portals what? is second? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. It beat Thunder Road and Sail. I don't know what else you yeah, could do to prove your second. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, that's shocking. That okay. is the best cover of the year right there, huh? All right, so a couple things before we sign that. out. I don't think we were done. Sorry. <laughs> She's shocked. She's like waiting Wait, for what? more. What? That's it? A couple things. <laughs> um, first of all, let's talk about this here. Ooh. This obviously is just for fun. In the comments, if there's a, a cover I missed, there's lots of covers that come out over the course of the year. I tried, but... Then, then say what that cover is. And then if you like what someone else said, thumb it up. And the one that gets the most thumbs will pin to the top. That way you can see another good option mm. for you. Yeah. Secondly, comment away all you want about this. But please don't mock other people and say you're stupid for liking covers. Every time we do these, people come in and like, people are so dumb at colors. And, uh, you clearly don't understand art. Yes, I'm not an artist. Yes, Full when, disclosure. And also, <laughs> oh these are fun covers to look at. And people are like, they're all terrible. Then you're in the wrong hobby. If you think all these covers look bad, mm. I don't. I'm, I'm, I feel bad for you. Yeah. Like, it's it's rare for me to see a cover and go, I don't like that at all. Most covers I like. Or like even I don't though. It's like okay, but someone else does. That's cool. That's great. You know, like it's yeah, something for everybody. There's a tremendous kind of amount of good yeah. artwork in this hobby right now. So, yeah. I agree. I agree. There's a lot of good stuff. But of course, we're not going to catch everything. Then after that. Um, this is it live for this week, right? There's nothing live scheduled for tomorrow, I don't believe. I don't think so. Nope. Nothing? Mm. Okay, great. Okay. Good. Yeah. Very, very good. <laughs> because the Winter Spectacular Excellent. starts on Monday. Come and join us. We're starting off with Board Game Breakfast, and then there will be so many top ten lists that by the end we'll do a top ten. No, we won't. A top ten list. We will not. But there is... A lot of top tens. It's all we're celebrating the best of the year, but we're also playing a ton of games. Many of the games that we showed you today, um, some of the well, not many of the games, but some of the games we showed you today are getting played. We mentioned a few of them going through, and others. We're gonna have the, is the schedule up online yet somewhere. We can post on YouTube. Yeah, we're gonna post the schedule soon, so keep that in mind. Secondly, keep an eye, or thirdly, or fourthly, or whatever. Keep an eye on the Dice Star website. Pretty soon, we're gonna open up voting for the top 100 games of all time, because we're doing that in January, and you'll have a chance to vote in that. And every year people are like, I didn't know. We're going to give you, like, three weeks to vote in it. So, mm -hmm. oh, I need to write the champion up here. Ice, ice, baby. baby. All right, also, all the artists who made these covers, congrats. Oh, my great, gosh. Great, great stuff. Really, really cool. Ice is illustrated and as Leonard DuPont, by the way. Leonard DuPont? Yeah. Congratulations. There are some, there are some that I'm surprised wasn't in, too, but... I'll grill you off camera. Also, I want to congratulate everyone on voting for these because you definitely voted on them based on the covers and not the games. Yeah. And I, I really appreciate say. that. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, it went really good, well. Good, yeah. good, good. All right. Until next time, I'm Tom Basil. I'm Camilla. I'm Z Garcia. And he likes donkeys. What?